A Day in the Life of Mukesh Yabani. Mukesh Yabani, in full Mukesh Dirabhai Yabani, born April 19, 1957 in Aden, Yemen, is a Yemeni-born Indian business mogul who is the chairman and managing director of the Indian conglomerate Reliance Industries Limited, the foremost company of the Indian energy and materials conglomerate Reliance Group. Like any other billionaire in the world, Abani has a fixed routine on how he goes throughout his day. In this video, we're going to look at a day in the life of Mukesh Ambani. Welcome back to our channel. If you haven't already, make sure you hit that subscribe button and ring the bell so that you get notified every time we upload a new video. Mukesh Ambani is a hard worker who doesn't waste time lazying around. He gets up between 5 a.m. and 5.30 a.m. every single day. He then heads to the gym located on the second floor of his luxurious Antilia home for an invigorating workout. After the workout, the billionaire heads to the swimming pool between 6 and 7.30 in the morning, and then he goes to the breakfast table on the 19th floor of Antilia. At breakfast, Mukesh likes to have papaya juice, porridge, or misirati with curd. If the day is Sunday, then on this day, Mukesh Ambani likes to have idli sambar for breakfast. Apart from this, if you talk about eating outside, then Mysura Cafe in Matunga, Mumbai is his favorite restaurant. Ambani is clearly very close to his family. He even asks for his mother's blessing before heading out to work every single day. And he talks with his wife, Nita, about his day at the office before going to bed. Between 9 a.m. and 10 a.m., Ambani is usually found on the 14th floor of Antilia, where he gets ready to go to his office. His assistants carry his office bags, laptops, and some important things related to the office. Again, the billionaire likes to spend some time with his mother, wife, and children before leaving the house. Mukesh puts in more hours than any other Reliance employee. Much of what he does within his office walls remain private, but they include meetings with top management, meeting investors, financial advisors, and market analysts. As of 2016, Ambani was ranked the 36th richest person in the world and has consistently held the title of India's richest person on Forbes magazine's list for the past 10 years. He is the only Indian businessman on Forbes' list of the world's most powerful people. As of October 2020, Mukesh Ambani was ranked by Forbes as the sixth wealthiest person in the world. He surpassed Jack Ma, executive chairman of Alibaba Group. To become Asia's richest person with a net worth of $44.3 billion in July 2018. He's also the wealthiest person in the world outside North America and Europe. As of 2015, Ambani ranked fifth among India's philanthropists, according to China's Hurin Research Institute. He was appointed as a director of Bank of America and became the first non-American to be on its board. He achieved all this thanks to his hard work. Ambani's daily work style and how he relates with his employees are unique. His leadership style is very distinctive. He is very different from how Steve Jobs or Michael Dell would function. Mukesh Ambani doesn't restrict himself to the traditional boundaries of monocratic, transformational, and situational leadership, among others. His own unique methods are what make the Mukesh Ambani leadership style. Ambani is a visionary. He can think of the future the unknown. He knows what technology will be feasible in the future. He understands the sustainability of a company and its potential not based on its present promises, but what it promises in the future. It is the ability of the Indian billionaire that has ensured the unprecedented success of Reliance Industries, a conglomerate that was founded by his father. Ambani is an impatient man. He wants solutions to the problems at the earliest. For that purpose, he employs only the best of the best. But one thing is for sure, he doesn't pretend that he knows the solution to each and every problem. He has always been of the view that smart leaders are those who have the ability to develop smart followers. As the head of Reliance Industries, Ambani earns $2 million a year. The sum isn't large considering the vast size of his company. What's more, it's the same salary he was earning 10 years ago. Ambani has deliberately capped his salary, stating that he wants to set an example of of moderation in managerial compensation levels. In a world where American CEOs make an average of $15.6 million per year, Ambani's example of moderation certainly stands out, setting him apart from the overwhelming majority of his international peers. Ambani returned
returns home from the office late at night, usually between 10 and 11 p.m. He goes straight to his bedroom, located on the 15th floor, and changes to home clothes. Between 11 p.m. and 12 a.m., the family comes together for dinner. Ambani takes dinner with his wife, Nita, on the 19th floor. He likes to have simple food consisting of chapati, rice, dal, vegetable, and salads. Mukesh is fond of South Indian and Guriati food, and likes to have it once or twice a week. After dinner, the billionaire talks to his wife Nita, shares, and discusses his personal experiences at the office during the day, and after that, his wife goes to sleep while Mukesh finishes off some official work before retiring to bed. Ambani is fond of Bollywood movies and generally watches all the movies even before they get released. What's more, Sunday is reserved for his family, and he spends the day in the company of his mother, wife, and three children. He's also blessed with a son-in-law and a daughter-in-law, as his two oldest children have already tied the knot. His youngest son, Anand, got engaged in 2020, which means the family can expect to grow even larger in the near future. While Abani is certainly a modest man in many ways, not all his hobbies are so modest. He enjoys collecting cars in his free time and currently has nearly 170 vehicles in his possession. Some particularly noteworthy pieces include a fully bulletproof BMW 670Li that costs more than $250,000 just to register, an Aston Martin Rapide, a Rolls-Royce Phantom, and a Bentley Continental Flying Spur. And that's how India's richest man spends his day. Before we leave, here is something about our guide. Did you know that Ambani is the owner of the largest refinery in the world? The billionaire commissioned a refinery in Jamnagar in Gujarat. The refinery can process 668,000 barrels in a single day, making it the largest refinery in the world today. Well, there you have it, a day in the life of Mukesh Ambani. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to check out more videos on our channel. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you next time.